Coach Tough game here today in Abilene, Texas. The Privateers fall 76 9 overtime. Yeah, a huge, uh, huge game out here. It's a hard, hard place to, to play and win each time we come out here. It comes down, uh, it seems like, to a crazy buzzer beater, and there was a lot of them, uh, both in regulation and overtime tonight. Uh, I'm very, very proud of the way the guys came back uh, from a nine point halftime de deficit, fought back, took the lead several times, didn't hold on. Uh, they hit a three to, t to take the lead right before regulation. We come back, answer with a great three. Uh, Coach Bailey did an unbelievable job drawing it up uh, in that time out there uh, to put us into overtime, and then uh, we just didn't didn't close out the overtime game. They had we had too many turnovers throughout the course of the game. Uh, some key, key mistakes uh, down the stretch where we lost focus and, and weren't able to get stops we needed. Uh, but, but a great basketball game, uh, just a, a great signature of what this league is all about, how tough it is night in and night out uh, in this league every, every single night. Fortunately, the Prophet has lost two in a row now, seven and three in league play. Um, seem to have a tough time scoring there and for a little part of the half. Defensively, you stop them, but couldn't get anything going on the offensive. Well, we, we, you know, we, 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 we just turned it over too much. I mean, we we're, were shooting 56% at halftime, uh, and we're down nine. And it was just costly turnovers, dumb turnovers, uh, stuff where we were uh, just not playing well and not doing the things that, that we needed to do. And it's disappointing that we played at a much higher rate, played much better, uh, just dug ourselves too big a hole uh, to be able to come out of this thing and recover. Uh, we, we left ourselves no margin. And like free throw shooting was a problem there, especially in overtime. Had a chance to really stay close. When you at ACU ran out to a 5-0 lead. You, you, I think you missed five or six to open the overtime period. Yeah, we, did, we, we didn't get to the line and make them. We, we struggled uh, today from that. We've been very good uh, for the majority of the year. Uh, tonight it cost us. There were some, there were some big ones that, you know, Tay's a 90% foul shooter uh, in conference play. He's been, you know, going into the year, he was a top 10 free, time, free throw percentage guy in, in school history and misses two very, very uncharacteristically of him. Um, so it's, it's frustrating. Of course, you had some bright spots to say Trayvon Thibodeau had another fantastic game. Yeah, he played really good, was, was a monster throughout the, throughout the game. Uh, played with great energy, and you know we got to keep him rolling on that. But uh, the whole thing, we just got to play better across the board, uh, and just keep keep grinding and keep working. You know, this is a tough swing uh, with four out of five or five out of six on the road. We knew it was going to be. Uh, we sure needed this one tonight, uh, really, really bad. And we need to we need to put all of our focus back on Saturday now. Uh, but just put a lot made our job a lot tougher. Off to Saturday, you're back home, uh, homecoming for the privateers and his fan base, alumni. Um, tell us to be back to be back home, man. Yeah, back it's going to be time. great to be home. You know, this this is a long stretch where, where we don't get to play at home much, uh, but a big one against a, a big rival in Nichols, a team that that's very very good this year, playing well. Uh, got some senior guys in Fry and Thomas that have been uh, really good throughout the year and throughout their careers, and we know our work's going to be cut out for us. But there's a ton of stuff happening. Uh, with everybody on campus. We know it's going to be a fun day for everybody coming back and all the student activities involved. So it's going to be a huge night. All right, Coach. Appreciate it. Thank you a lot.